Hello, this is Uday. In this video, we will learn about the entire function in the SQL Server. So, entire function is one of the four window ranking functions available in the SQL Server, where we have got four different ranking functions, namely row number, rank, dense rank, and then the entire. So, the row number and the dense rank we have already covered using separate videos. We have provided detailed information about what exactly is the row number function and rank and dense rank. How are those different from each other? I would suggest you to please go and watch those videos in order to have complete information about row number, rank and dense rank functions. The link for the videos are being provided in the description below. Now let's come back to the entire function. Let's try to understand uh, the entire function using an example. This is an employee table which contains an employee detail, employee name, salary, department IDs and so on. Here is a result set example where bin pulled using the entire function where we can see the department IDs are being sorted in the ascending order and then there is another column entire value which we can see has created certain groups where it, it has divided into equal parts for those department IDs. In this, we can see that department ID 1 has 4 rows. However, entire value has only 3 numbers. Now, what entire value is doing is it is trying to create 3 equal uh, divisions for the department ID for these 4 rows. However, it cannot create three equal parts for the four rows hence it has assigned the more records to the starting group and then less to the following ones similarly we can see for the department id 2 there are seven rows it has assigned more numbers to the starting group one and followed by the lesser number in the following group so this is what the entire function does it divides the rows into equal number of parts within group in case the result set is not exactly divisible into an equal number of records it assigns more records to the starting groups and less to the following ones let's see the syntax for the entire function the syntax is quite simple it has the entire keyword followed by the integer expression which contains the number integer number into which how many divisions we want to create for those number of rows and then the over clause which is mandatory in all the window ranking functions followed by the part partition by clause and the order by clause the partition by clause is optional in the entire function let's look at this example query where we are trying to pull the employee name salary department ids from the employee table including this we can see the entire function is applied for the department IDs where the department IDs are being equally divided into three equal numbers ordered by salary in the descending order. Let's try to understand this using a SQL queries. Here we have got a table employee. Let's try to write a basic query namely employee name, salary, department ID and in the entire function we want to divide the rows into three equal parts over now in this function i don't want to partition anything i just want to apply this entire function for the entire row hence i would just provide the order by clause for salary in the descending order let's give an allies name to this column in the entire value all the columns are being pulled from the table employee Let's try to execute this query. We can see that the entire result set is being almost equally divided into three equal parts. Whereas the number 14 cannot be equally divided into three. Hence, it has assigned more records to the starting group and lesser records to the following groups. Let's try to see one more example using select employee name, salary, department ID and then in the entire function what we can do is we are trying to divide the rows into four equal parts over here i want to group the department ids using partition by department id and then order by 
salary in the descending order. Let's try to give the name as the entire value from employee table. Now, when we execute this query, we can see that the entire function has divided the equal number of rows within the department IDs. We can see for department ID 1, it has created four equal records. And for department ID 2, it has tried to create four equal records. And for department ID 3, since there is no four re fourth record, it has only assigned three rows. So this is the basic example and the basic information of the entire value. Let's try to see the summary of what exactly the entire function contains. The entire function takes an integer as an input and divides the record of the result set into the number of groups. And then in case the result set is not exactly divisible into an equal number, it assigns more records to the starting group and lesser records to the following ones. Within each group, each record will have the same number or the rank. Now, what we have seen is like there are two cases where the entire function can be executed. One is the ranking entire result set using order by clause. And then the second one is rank, ranking partition result using a partition by clause. I hope this video is helpful to you. If you are new to the channel, please subscribe to the channel and hit the like button for this video. Thank you.